Alright guys, welcome back to more PS5 Master League. We are back at Anfield today and we are playing Arsenal in the second leg of the quarterfinal cup game. So it ended 0-0 in the last one. We had so many chances and we could not score a single one of them because it just wasn't happening. So yeah, Mutu, Torres up front today, Gerard sitting behind them in the midfield. As you well know, Ronaldo and uh, Heitinger and the like are still on their international duty, of course, so they are not playing in this one, which is a massive shame because we really could do with Ronaldo on a big night like tonight, but not to be. Here's uh, Ramos, who is playing at the back, Puyol. We've got Maldini at the back as well, and uh, Risa. So, uh, yeah, Maldini is going to take um, uh, Heitinger's normal position tonight, and that's how we are going. Here's Hoyt. And, uh, yeah, so we... Oh, this is bad. It's Lundberg. And... Okay, well, they had an opportunity there, but it didn't go quite right for them. Um, yeah, Dijon, DMF as well. I haven't mentioned that. Um, that's about it. So, yeah, we took uh, Owusu Abia off Arsenal in the last episode <laughs> and um, swapped him for Robin. And... Uh, yeah, we've had a few swap deals with Arsenal. Uh, they they took um, Rubinho off us um, back in the... Was it the summer? Yeah, it would have been. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, I'm acting like I'm completely drunk here or something, aren't I? Um, so I'll, I'll try to be a little bit more sensible if I can. Uh, checking goal for us as well today. And that's about it. Uh, I don't think there's really anything else to say other than that. Oh, yeah, Iniesta is playing as well, so... Yeah, um, Palm, who is second uh, in the league for the Golden Boots, he's on 12 goals, so he's having a very good season. Uh, so yeah, Arsenal, they got off to a really good start this season, and then they just started slipping and declining, and I don't know why, it was weird. Uh, we've gone back to the 4-4-2 diamond today, because that worked really well in the last episode. Mafio is playing, did I not mention Mafio? I'm, I apologise, he is such a legend, and for me to forget about him is just not good enough. It's really not. Um, and I think that's all I wanted to say. Here's Ramos. Ramos. Oh, E. That's an offside by Mutu, is it? Yeah, apparently. Uh, yeah, Mutu and Torres, like the good old partnership of like the season, I don't know, four days and five, I think, a little bit. We had Ronaldinho up front a lot of the time back in season five. He was really good when he was about. He's on the bench, actually. Today's Ronaldinho, so yeah, that's something. Arsenal, though, we cannot concede today. It'll be really bad to concede against Arsenal today. Because if we do that, um, well, it, like I say, it'll be really bad. <laughs> but no, what I'm trying to say is um, they've got an away advantage today. So if they do score, we are in a lot of danger. So, yeah. Uh, I don't know what was meant to be happening with that. There's Gerard. Here is Mafia. What? What a save by Fatecha, to be fair to him. I think Fatecha is starting to get a lot better as the years have gone on. Since the infamous Season 2 days, of course, guys. Which uh, we will not forget about, of course. And, oh, Iniesta nearly latched onto the end of that one. Risa being held up about something there. Maybe a little push, a little pushy push. And here's Mutu. Mutu's on a run. He's going for it. He's going for it. Good old Mui. There's Hoyt. There's Larson. Smith, that's cut out. Here's Iniesta. It's Torres. It's Torres. It's nobody's. Unlucky. Larson, oh, oh, that's bad, and check, he's going to have to come out towards it, he had no choice but to there, oh, that could have easily gone back to, uh, I think that was Mutu there, was it Torres, it was one of them, <laughs> it was one of them, wasn't really paying too much attention there, here's Torres, oh, that's unlucky for Gerard. Gerard. Oh, got the uh, throwing in a dangerous position. 
we have at least that much. Here's Gerard again. What is... Gerard, what was that? Here he is again. He's got another crack at it. No, he's not, because he's taken it out of play like an idiot. <laughs> Here's Gilberto Silva. Here's Larson. Nothing really happening in this first half. Pretty kind of even game. Here's Torre. Stopped by Ramos. Here's De Jong. There's Puyol there. Here's Ramos. And it's Mutu. I think he's offside. Yeah, he's offside. Ah! Mui, what are you doing? Get on side, man. Going to be the halftime whistle in a moment. Reese are in there to stop that. And opportunity here, maybe not. Uh, half time, not really anything to say. There's going to have to be a winner by the end of this, though. There's going to have to be something along the lines. Nil nil at the break. So we've had a what 135 minutes of football played in this tie, and nothing to show for it. Nothing at all from either team. Very close, though. It's been very close. <laughs> Especially in that first leg. Here's Gerard. It's Mutu. It's Torres. Oh, we we're just saying how there's been absolutely nothing. And then Torres just shows us up, baby. Still, we are not out of the woods yet. Not out of the woods yet. Far from it. Ideally need a second goal in this. Mutu finds Torres. He finds the bottom corner. Slots it past for Tetra. Liverpool looking to make the semi-finals tonight. Could do that here. Nice pass by Gerard. Mutu just goes for this one. Torres one-on-one. -on -one. And it's not often you'd bet against Torres to not put it away. Game on here at Anfield. Here's Lundberg. Here's Smith. Oh, Mafia with a nice sliding challenge there. Here's Mutu. Liverpool going again. It's Mutu. It's Mutu. Oh. Oh, he's looking at that. He says, I fancy that. Go on. <laughs> you know, go on, go on, why not? Have a pop. Have a little cheeky pop. Here's uh, De Jong. It's Risa. Oh, that's going to be a corner, I believe. Oh, it's not. Oh, come on. Oh, that's bad. Oh, check. What a legend. Oh my, he's such a ledge. He keeps us in check. Yeah, get it? No, nope, that was really bad. Here's Larson. Smith, Reese are in the good position to take it. Here's Hoyt. Ooh, Mafio. A little bit dangerous there. A bit, bit reckless. A little bit reckless. What was that? Is that Senderos being a tool? Risa finds Mafio. That's going to be a corner. Iniesta to take. It's in there. Oh, it's running into it. I think it was Mutu there. Iniesta again. He's looking for someone. It's not finding anyone. He's marching. 
Oh, come on. Is that Gerard? It's Mafio. Stopped. Mutu's tripped. Too many trips, man. Too many trips. And I think that's going to stay just in play. Oh, it's actually gone for the corner there. Arsenal fans not happy about that. And uh, hey, Mutu there on the near post. That was just never going to happen, was it? Oh, mistake there. Here's Gerard. Here's Torres. It's Torres! 2 0. Gotta be now. Gotta be now. He's the man today. Whose ball was that? That was a great ball. <laughs> Who was that? Is that any Esther's ball there? Both the uh, Spanish players linking up there for that goal. Nicely done. This is why this is why we prepared for this game, so we didn't play as many like important players for the uh, Rangers game. We sort of changed it up because we was we was nervous about this one, but uh, not over yet. Twenty minutes still to get through. In the 69th minute here, hey, hey. nice. Here's Ho <laughs> here's Hoyt. Oh, it's oh, this is pretty good. It's Gerard. It's Iniesta. It's Mutu. It's Risa. Risa's just gonna go for it. But nothing happens. Rubinho's coming on for Gary. Gary is coming off. Iniesta whips it in. Header! Oh! Spacious. <laughs> I can't believe he missed that, Torres. Ah, he must have just got the angle all wrong there. It's weird. And ball coming over. And kept out. That's an offside, I believe, by Lundberg. So, yeah. Yeah, it is. Abia is uh, cup tied for this one. Can't, can't play him. Can't play him. Not going to do it. You can do it if you want. So, uh, yeah. If Arsenal want to play Robin, well, they're going to have to give us money for that. <laughs> you know, pay, pay it up. It's like a, uh, like a game of Monopoly or something. You know, pay the rent. If you want to, uh, if you want to play this player or something, I don't know. I, I'm maybe I have had something to drink, guys. I'm not sure. <laughs> Here is Reyes for Lundberg. Oh, what was that attempt? It missed, but still. Some subs in a moment gonna come on just for the final few minutes. I think we've played a good enough game here. So yeah, here's Marchand again. And oh, he's doing a few step overs, trying to do a Ronaldo and cut inside. Not working out for him. No, nope, didn't work out for you, buddy. Smashing again. His J J. Okay, Mafio does a good enough job there. Here's Torres. Here's Muto. It's Torres. He's looking for the hat trick. Can he do it? It's Torres. It's Muto. Oh, baby. There we go. 3 0. Bob's your uncle. And you know who your damn man is. What were we worried about? You're thinking, oh, Torres has got to go for this. He's got to get the hat trick to do. Nope. A little bit of sweaty edge on it. Mutu's in a better position for that. Fatetra tries to get across. Doesn't quite do it. Cliche, Cafu and Babel all on for these final few minutes. And let's get going again here. Could there be a fourth just to cap it off with? Who knows? Here's Babel. Here's Mafio. Mafio's played a good game today. Cliche here. Oh, 
Oh, it's Babel! It's Babel! Oh! He had to take it. Damn, that would have been a good little finish to the game, wouldn't it? <laughs> oh well, that that's the game. You know what, that was a good game in the end there. First half, it was kind of like the last game we played where the first half was kind of a little bit slow, but we really picked it up in the second half. And uh, there we go. Avoiding penalties is like the biggest thing. <laughs> in the cup. I, well, you don't want penalties, do you? It's not, it's not a good way to go out. Well, it was always going to be Torres as the man of the match, wasn't it? 7.5. I'm a little bit concerned with that. To be honest, I thought he probably would have had an 8 there. I mean, if he got the goal at the end for himself, it probably would have been an 8 and uh, whatnot. But uh, yeah, it was man of the match anyway. He was always going to get it. Uh, Gerard 7.0. Dijon, 6.5. Mafio with a 6. Just a 6. I thought he was better than that. I thought he was really good, Mafio, defensively and whatnot. And making some passes. I give him I give him at least a six point five or a seven from me to do. Uh Mutu seven point five with that goal at the end there. And uh, the defence, these guys were solid. Maldini was solid. You know what I mean? He's got to learn some somehow or some way and giving him more game time will be the answer to that. So uh Schneider, Heitinger and Ronaldo are all back now, but they've got a lot of fatigue. So they're probably not gonna play for a few weeks yet. But this is how it went tonight. Manchester United won two one yet again. So they went through four two overall against Newcastle. Bolton won overall in the end, but it ended up being four three. Aston Villa won 2-0 on the night, but they went through because the first leg was so good for them. <laughs> so, uh, pretty lucky there. And Chelsea won 2-0 on the night to win three overall against Spurs. So, this is what it looks like for the semi-finals. Over here, you can see that Bolton are playing Chelsea. Bolton have got a good chance to go into that final. To be honest, I'd be really worried if we had to play Bolton in that final, the way they've been playing this season. We already lost to them in the league. So, uh, yeah, you know... Uh, you know, I, I wish them all the luck in uh, getting to the final. Maybe we can meet them there. For us, it's going to be Manchester United in the semi-final. It's not coming up for a while yet, but uh, we'll get around to it when we do. So that will be coming up at some point. Anyway, we are back to the league in the next episode, guys. So uh, this is what it brings us. we got Fulham against Spurs. we got Newcastle. They're at Bolton. I, why do I get this niggling feeling that Newcastle are going to win that, even though they're not doing well this season, but Bolton are? But it's going to be one of those where it's like the team that's doing better always like loses that game for whatever reason. Is it me or is it always a way team seem to win quite a lot? I don't know. Anyway, um, Wigan, they're at home against uh, Blackburn. We've got Millsborough against We United. We've got Arsenal at Manchester United. Oofed. we got um, Everton against Rangers and Chelsea against Aston Villa. But for us, it is going to be a way at West Brom next and it's not to be taken lightly because uh, West Brom are a pretty good team and they could give us some major trouble in this next one who knows but uh, we were we're preparing for the Champions League again because we got Inter coming up pretty soon so yeah join us for that next time guys please do comment, rate, subscribe and share as always we'll have a look at our team and see what we're going to do for the next one and I don't know 442 Diamond is it back permanently because it seems to be working pretty well I don't know We'll think about it. See you then. Take care.